Hey, Drop Tech fans. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we've got something exciting to talk about, the next big One UI update from Samsung. Even though Samsung is a bit behind on the One UI 7 update based on Android 15, they're already moving fast with the development of One UI 8, which is going to be based on Android 16. So, let's break it down and see what's really going on. Recently, well-known tipster Tarun Vats shared something interesting on Twitter. He mentioned that the first internal test build of One UI 8 for the Galaxy S25 series has already been spotted on Samsung's servers. The build ends with BC1, which confirms that it's built on Android 16. Here's the interesting part. Samsung seems to have started working on One UI 8 development two months earlier than usual. And the reason? Google has also begun testing Android 16 beta earlier than expected, which gave Samsung a head start. This could help Samsung release One UI 8 right on schedule, or maybe even a bit earlier. Now, here's a bit of a bummer. Samsung won't be releasing One UI 7.1 or 7.1.1 this year. These versions usually bring a few extra features and polish, but because One UI 7 itself got delayed, there's just not enough time to push out two more updates before moving on to One UI 8. Samsung is aiming to roll out the stable version of One UI 7 sometime in April, but considering how updates work, it could take two to three months to reach all eligible devices. That means by June or July, we might already see the first One UI 8 beta, with a stable release possibly dropping around August or September. Many users are understandably frustrated with how late One UI 7 has been, but Samsung insists that the delay is because they wanted it to be the most stable and feature-rich version yet. They say it includes smoother animations, better performance, and lots of new features. Still, a lot of users feel the delay could have been avoided. But at this point, it's already behind schedule, so let's focus on what's coming next. Even though we don't know everything about One UI 8 just yet, some early leaks are giving us an idea of what to expect. Right now, you can do this through Goodlock's Lockstar module, but One UI 8 might include it as a built-in feature, so you won't need good lock anymore. Just like how Samsung DeX works, this Android 16 feature might let you move your mouse from your phone to an external monitor and back, making multitasking even smoother. Inspired by Apple's iOS 18, Samsung might introduce animated black dots along the screen's edges. These would adjust with your movement, helping your brain stay in sync with what you're seeing, especially useful while traveling in vehicles. Samsung is also working on upgrading the Now Bar, which is already available on Galaxy devices. At the moment, it shows live notifications and activity updates, but with One UI 8, Samsung might integrate iPowered features. Here's what they might include. AI curated travel info based on your upcoming trip. Real-time ETA to the airport if your flight details are saved. Smart suggestions of important files or folders for travel. All of this would be shown directly in the now bar, making it more helpful than ever before. And yes, Samsung says these AI features will stay free until the end of 2025, but from 2026, some may become paid add-ons. So, to sum it up, One UI 7 is coming soon but One UI 8 is already in development and could arrive much sooner than expected. This is great news for Galaxy users, especially those planning to get the Galaxy S25 series. We'll keep you posted with any updates on One UI 7's rollout and when the One UI 8 beta drops. And yes, a full review of One UI 7 will also be on the way once it's live, so don't miss that. And hey, if you haven't yet, go check out our wallpaper app, WVER. It's packed with beautiful high-quality wallpapers, and we offer both free and premium versions. Free users will see ads, but with premium, you get an ad-free experience and access to exclusive collections. That's all for today's update, Drop Tech Fam. If you found this video helpful or informative, make sure to give it a like and hit that subscribe button for more regular tech updates. Also, tap the bell icon so you don't miss any future uploads. Thanks for watching, take care, and stay safe. We'll catch you in the next video. Peace out.